from Horror Tree back again with another lineup of my Horror Tree weekly wrap ups. And today, as usual, I'll be talking to you about four submission calls that are currently up on the Horror Tree website. So let's get started. Okay, first up is World Smiths, Written in the Wind, Fantastic Tales on the Power of Names. So the theme for this is they're after speculative fiction and the theme is what's in a name. Is it a simple collection of symbols and sounds or something more? This collection of fantasy short stories will explore names and the power they hold over us. So featuring stories from the World Smiths community, that's you, um, these tales will show you new worlds and open up your mind to the power of names. They are after stories of between 2,000 and 4,000 words. Payment is 20 US dollars and the submissions close on the 30th of June. Okay, moving on to Dark Dragon Publishing. Now, the theme for this is life is the dance between choice and chance. Okay, so they want you to think about how did you come to the point in life where you find yourself now. Two factors were likely in play, choice and chance. So the choices we make are clearly a factor in shaping our life. For example, a woman in one universe elopes with her high school sweetheart, but they are too young to make the marriage work and divorce at an early age. In a second universe, she marries him after they graduate from university and she happily becomes a stay-at-home mum. In a third universe, she doesn't marry him and pursues a, a successful career instead. Making different choices about the same life goal can lead to very different lives. Each story submitted to the dance to this submission call must contain three parts set in three different universes. The universes should be distinct. So they are after stories of with a maximum word count of 10,000 words, though 6,000 to 7,000 words is the sweet spot. No multiple or simultaneous submissions for this one. Payment is 1% of net sales and the submission is closed on the 1st of August. Okay, and moving on to B Cubed Press, Alternate Truths, Southern Edition, Bless Their Hearts. Okay. So the theme for this is they will examine the South, a place where politicians and their followers compete to peg the outrage meter. Why and how are they turning the United States into a cauldron of bigotry and hate? For example, they are banning books. They are controlling free speech. They have placed bounties on abortion seekers. It goes on and on. They want you to give them stories that speak to the consequences of such a mindset and where it may be taking us as individuals and as a culture. What, if left untreated, would they make of America, the world and the future? And more important, how, how will we fight to stop them? They're after stories, essays and poems for this. So for stories, they're looking for a word count of between 200 to 5,000 words though 2,500 is the sweet spot and most likely to get an acceptance. Though if your story needs to be longer, go for it. Poems should be submitted as you desire to see them printed and only one poem per submission. Multiple and simultaneous submissions are okay. Um, payment is three cents per word and the submission window opens on the 1st of May and closes on the 30th of July. Okay, next up is Allegory Volume 44. So the theme for this is speculative fiction, primarily horror, sci-fi and fantasy. So they're looking for good fiction, good solid fiction. They specialize in sci-fi, fantasy and horror genres. They will consider other genres such as humor or general interest, provided that the work possesses an original quirky slant. Um, and please check the website for more information on this submission call because there's a lot more detail than I can go into on this video right here, right now. So please get online and check it out because it's a bit more 
detail than what I can give you here. Um, there is no minimum or maximum length for fiction, but bear in mind that short stories and flash fiction are usually hard sells and stories longer than 5,000 words also fall into that category. They will consider them, but they have to be exceptional. Nonfiction guidelines. Now these guys publish one or two articles per issue. The subject matter must involve the art or business of writing, research, editing, characterization, virtually any topic that concerns writing is fair game. The maximum length for non-fiction is 2,000 words and reprints are most welcome. Payment is $15 and the submissions open on the 1st of May and close on the 30th of June. And there we have it guys, another amazing week of amazing submission calls by amazing publishers. So hopefully there's something there that grabs your interest and makes you want to write and create and submit. So if you are thinking of submitting, all the very best of luck to you. And of course, if you are wanting to submit, all the information you need is up on the Horror Tree website. Jump on there, check it out. Everything you need is up there. Go on and do it. And as always, if you are watching these videos and you're enjoying them, please hit subscribe, hit like, hit comment, hit share, flick us an email, let us know what you think. We would absolutely love to hear from you. And if you are watching again, thank you so much. You are all rock stars. We really do appreciate it. Okay, until next time, guys, thank you again and stay safe, stay cool, stay spooky. See you later.